Hi, this is Philippe. Welcome to Concert Classical Guitars, Paris. Let's talk about guitars today. And um, I just discovered this new guitar a few minutes ago. So I'm a little fresh on this one, but sometimes it's kind of uh, better just to, to, be, to be fair. And this is a, a double top without Nomex, just wood in between of the two uh, tops, which are spruce. Uh, this guitar is made by Alexander Pachinsev in Russia. This is his number 196. What I can say, this guitar has a very modern look. Um, it makes me think about the Wagner, uh, Wagner double top from Germany that I've uh, seen some, some times ago uh, with the very nice uh, rounded head edge here and there in the back. Very nicely made. The rosette make, makes me think a little bit of the, the Fleta rosette. Uh, very nice, uh, I think it's Paduk bridge with um, uh, 12 hole tie block. Very nice. There's a mosaic inlaid in, in the top of the, the top of the guitar, close to the bindings. Uh, that's the same mosaic of the rosette. And by the way, that's the same here. Uh, it's a gorgeous instrument. The back and sides were, are made of uh, Indian rosewood. Very nice uh, grain, it's quarter sound grain straight grain very nice reinforced uh cedar neck like uh, the spanish style very classy tuning machine made in germany um very nice and uh very cool head with the inlay in, in the middle something like snake wood or something else uh ebony fretboard elevated fretboard too uh, i believe this is extra c note so this guitar has it all let's check out the sound of this uh, very nice guitar it's white a white guitar very clear kind of a, like a traditional sound sounding guitar with a, a little more volume The setup is just just really cool very very easy to play as you can notice there's no buzz that's my no those are my first notes on this guitar so. playing perfect two side dots make marker here are the fifth fret and the seventh fret that's very very nice Then there, uh, very nice, and uh, a string. So this is a, a double top, but this is also a spruce top, so it needs time to, to age and to, to open a bit. It's already a very nice sound. Eh? Kind of round. There's also some overtones coming. Without the nail. Very nice and sweet. 
little boop in the sound. When the sound is not right, it's not the guitar, it's my fingers. Then the four string, D string. It's very round on the... I have muted all the strings and the note is as a long sustain and reacts very nicely musically to the vibrato. Very, very interesting guitar. Then the G string. Very creamy. Like it's supposed to be for a double top, I guess. starts to open up a little bit. Very, very nice guitar if I play some chords. Very nice, a lot of tone colors in this guitar. If I play the melody with the basses, This is um, a very, very cool guitar coming from uh, Russia and um, like uh, Russian girls, this guitar has a lot of uh, attracts and it's, um, it's a blonde girl, um, oh, she's, uh, she's very sexy, it's a very sexy guitar, 
uh, with a very sweet and creamy tone. That's a lot of pleasure. And um, I will end this with a new thing so you can hear the trebles and the basses. And thank you for watching and stay tuned for new adventures of the new guitars. Thank you guys. <laughs>